Welcome back, folks, to Let's Play Neverwinter Nights. When last we left off, we were on the second floor of the prism, and this door is not as deadly as I thought it might be. It's just a slow spell. Your it does mean we walk very slowly, and it means we attack much slower. Die! However, we could still probably take care of all this. It is, after all, only four escape prisoners. They are only hitting me for one point of damage. Medium clubs, after all, only do two, uh, one to six point of damage. Times two crit threat. Not that dangerous. Oh, and we are no longer slowed. Ooh, first aid kit. And another chest and a gold piece. Fair enough. This is the locked chest. Obviously the one with all the loot in it. Done and done. There we go. Another Melf's Acid Arrow. There is a door over here that I am interested to explore. And I believe we have mapped out this area in its entirety. Are there any guards here? There are. Not only are there guards here, but there's also an open door. And the bear, by teleporting there, has lured the entire contents of this area. Oh my word, there's an escaped sorcerer. That is a, not a good thing. I am hoping that we uh, do not have to deal with that. Oh, that's a fireball. Okay, follow me, follow me. That's bad. That's really bad. That indeed is a fireball. It's a moderately high level yes. sorcerer. Is there something? We don't really want to talk right now. <sighs> kind of have an issue. I'll spell your... <sighs> no, no, I, I don't think you will be. <sighs> Probably should heal the bear. The main problem we have is that was a fireball. Fireballs are nasty. That implies that the sorcerer is at least 6th level. And that's why he's challenging. We should save over a different file, actually. Hmm. The best strategy, I think, is just to rush the sorcerer. After looting these things, of course. I mean... Can't see him anymore. He's in here somewhere. Where is he? There he is! Oh! There he was! Ready to fire a fireball just from invisibility. Mm. That is a little annoying. Fortunately, we had saved. We could just go rest. Alternatively, I could turn into a bear. That will solve a problem. Hello! You thought you could do much by turning invisible, eh? Bad problem with this plan is that uh, you just got dazed and you are being uh, basically attacked by a bear. Yeah, I think the sorcerer is nearly dead. Well, that definitely worked. If in doubt, transform into a bear. The sorcerer dropped some loot some darts. That's pretty much it. Is there anything else in here? Oh, there is one escaped prisoner. <coughs> Prepare one. To become one. Yep, there are two bears. That's not a good thing for you. Trust me. Can we rest here? Can I just rest as a bear? Interesting question. Yes, you just sort of stay as a bear. Interesting. How many hit points do I have as a bear? 66. That's more hit points. No, 56, sorry. That's less hit points than uh, Crumpet. You do turn back into a... Uh... Oh. The cell doors have opened. That's good, because I kind of wanted to loot them all. Fair enough. That one is locked. Second floor seems a little easy compared to the first. But I imagine we haven't gone into a third floor yet. And we have yet to loot anything really significant. This one is also locked. Just gonna move out the way. These all seem pretty easy to unlock, mind you. 
Ha! Great looting! Oh. Ooh, that one's trapped. Why do I get the feeling that that's a death chest? This chest contains death! No, it contains minor annoyance. Minor annoyance? Hello, prisoners! You hit me for one point of damage. For that, you will die. Admittedly, you were going to die if you didn't hit me at all, just because you're aggressive to me. Prepare to become one. See, that one hit me for three. And got 19 points of damage in return. Yeah, at this point, you'd be wanting to surrender, I think. Not a good plan going up against Sarken here. Really poor plan. Are there any other... There are a few other chests. They're all over here. Fair enough. That one is locked. We shall tell her... Uh, oh! It's locked in that way. Blast! You are not going to actually try and unlock it properly, are you? Nope. You can try and unlock that one, though. Excellent. There are some chests we just are not able to unlock. But that seems okay. We're doing pretty well at dealing with all this. Okay, so every single cell is now unlocked. Which means... That we should be able to loot everything on these. It's going to take a little while to circle all the way around. There are... Oh, there are also a few combats as well. Like this prisoner. That was a very short combat. Did you drop anything? You actually did. More Thieves' Tools. Okay, there are 12 little cells to explore. And each one seems to have something in it, which is useful. I suppose, in theory, you don't even need to actually go into the central area. You can just bypass it entirely and go straight down to the pits. <laughs> I decided not to do that, mind you. Was there anything down here? Ah, more prisoners. Might as well kill these two. Yeah, you're not really much of a threat, escape prisoner. And your other identical twins, escape prisoner and escape prisoner. You do at least have proper weapons. That's not really going to help you, though. No, that, that's really just not going to help you. And none of them had any loot. Suppose I wasn't expecting them to. Oh, and a slow trap. Probably with... Yep. More oh, prisoners. You, you may try. I think the only thing that's going to happen, unfortunately, is we're going to carve <laughs> you up. Uh. That slow trap is not going to be forever. I mean, they have, like, plus zero and plus two to hit. They're only really hitting me on criticals. Whereas I have plus... Let's have a look. A fair bit. It says here... Plus six attack bonus. Not bad. One more to go. Pretty sure you're in trouble. <laughs> yep. And that's you dead. Four gold. A gold. Two more chests. Locked. And locked. Uh, you should probably get out of the way, Crumpet. This way. There we go. She'll unlock that one, and then we'll get her to unlock this one. I think that's all of the uh, done and done. secure rooms dealt with. There you go. She can unlock that too. Excellent. Very useful companion to have. Very useful companion to have. Nine gold and a potion. We can always do with more potions. Pretty sure I already examined this one. Yeah, I did. Excellent. Not sure why there was a bit of momentary slowdown there, but there you go. In here is nothing, because I think we've already looted that one, so I think we have a fair few more to go. 
Stairs up there. We don't want to go into those just yet. Although we do want to go back in there and let him... Oh, more robes of light. I would say they're handy, but to be honest, they're not. I suppose if you're a wizard, they're probably useful. At this point, maybe. Wouldn't we get any sort of protective clothing at all? Like, uh, arm, like robes that provide even one armor class, or do something that isn't just sheds light. Light isn't really so much of an issue as it is in um, actual D&D. Because, yeah, it makes things a little brighter, but it doesn't actually solve any problems. There aren't, as far as I can see, any situations where not having a glowing source of glowiness is going to make a significant difference. Now, having fires in one of the lairs of hell, as we remember from Hordes of the Underdark, that's important. We are nearly done. Four gold, and I do think a corpse. We're not looting the corpse. There we go. You should still be in here, and we'll tell them that everyone is dead. I greet you. Oh, all right. He's not actually going to talk to us and, uh, until we lock the door. I greet you. Okay, wait here. There is actually nothing we can do with you anymore. You'll actually refuse to talk to me entirely until we, uh, secure the door. Makes sense, I suppose. Well, there isn't anyone else here to actually deal with, uh... I wonder who sat in that chair. Maybe the jailer? Perhaps. Wouldn't be surprised if there was someone here waiting to attack us, but no. Just a scorch mark. I might talk to Sharmin, actually, before we go down to the next area. Hmm. Yeah, I'll give that a go. Why not? Hello. Yes? Is that... Continue your story from before. Nope. She doesn't want to talk about it right now. Yes? Uh, no advice about the mission. Fair enough. Just checking to see if she had any other dialogue options that were interesting. But let's go down to the pit. Because we haven't killed enough prisoners. The pit is... Not great. The pit is... Yeah, pretty bad. There are lots of prisoners. They're all over the place. And unlike in the other place, there is much less order here. There are boxes and barrels, though. Apparently a cage there. Makes me question what they were doing in the pit. Well, there you go. The pit right now is full of extremely dangerous prisoners that we need to deal with. <laughs> Prepare to become... Ah, these ones are dual wielding. They're obviously not very good at it, because, well, admittedly, that one's able to phase through solid metal. But that didn't give him the ability to actually hit me. Having brilliant energy daggers and still managing to fail. Ouch. And here is some more... pit. This just... seems like a gauntlet, if you ask me. It's just a gauntlet of, uh... rooms. I can see that far without actually being in the room. Ooh, a lot of pri oh, 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 a lot of prisoners. That's a lot of prisoners. It's a lot of prisoners. Come on, Crumpet. I need your help here. There we go. Much better. No, no, no. Don't move me back. We need Crumpet to be able to hit things. Like that, see? Much better. There we go. Ding! Really shouldn't make that sound considering that the uh, shield is made of wood. There we go. More loot. Gold piece here, a gold piece there, and before you know it, we'll be rich. Or not. Yep, see, a gold piece here, a gold piece there, and we'll have a gold piece here and there. We're not going to be super rich. Hmm, there are lots of doors leading off from here, but I have no real clue as to which one to go to. Well, we might as well open one of them. Let's open this one first. Well, you trigger the trap. Hmm. 
in there seems to be more of the pits. Well, I'm not surprised. Why are you running back there to attack Sharwin? Yeah, I'm just going to deal with that. Oh, no Crumpet's going to deal with that. Never mind. Crumpet was more than capable of dealing with that. And I was thinking of taking a wolf with me rather than a bear. Imagine what that'd have been like. The bear's a powerhouse. Can I rest here? No, there are enemies nearby. Might as well just cure myself then. Here we go. A little bit of healing. And we'll go through this door. Fair enough. Ooh, we cannot go through this door. We can now go through this door. Maybe it'll shorten our journey. Whoa! Ha! Suddenly guard dog. And a lot of chests. What's a guard dog doing down here? If they say that they basically just leave this place to it. Whoa, this guard dog is difficult. Rather, it just hit me for a lot of da It's 21 damage I dealt to it. But it dealt me a fair bit of damage too. Any more guard dogs? No. Fair enough. Locked. Fair enough. Locked. Not locked. And not locked. And also, stop that. Thank you. Done and done. Fair you enough. can unlock that as well while we're here. Thank you. Done and done. Mm, more gems. Always do with more gems. Don't think there's anything really valuable. There's still more enemies to fight. I'm not surprised about that. We are, after all, breaking into a prison that Fair is now enough. controlled by the prisoners. There we yes? go. Yes? Is there something you need? No, 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 I, I accidentally clicked you instead of the door. Out of our way! Oh, no! There is an escaped sorcerer in here. This day. That's bad. Uh. Yep, that's why. I won't let it end like this. No, we won't. We're basically going to uh, turn into a bear. I need healing. Quickly. Uh. Yep, that's why we needed healing quickly. Because we got hit by a sorcerer, and that was painful. I should probably preemptively turn into a bear, actually, truth be told, if that's going to happen. Definitely preemptively turn into a bear. Admittedly, I can't even begin to attempt to unlock a door, but I can order Crumpet not to try and uh, bash the door in. Let's do this as a bear, shall we? Probably go a lot better if I'm actually a bear rather than a druid. A bear done druid! And done. Thank you, Sharwin. Let's go. Straight you for the sorcerer! Now. Oh, straight for the sorcerer. Uh, okay, cannot go straight for the sorcerer. Where is the sorcerer? Where is the sorcerer? There. Whoa! Now let's get that sorcerer. Here we go. There we go. No invisibility for you. Now you're in serious trouble. Yep, you're in serious trouble. Mauled by bears. It worked. We can still loot things as a bear. Also, we get to level up now. Six level. Excellent. We get to improve our animal empathy. We get to improve our concentration. We get to improve our persuade and our spellcraft. And we get a feat. We also get an extra use of wild shape. It recommends power attack. Hmm. Maybe. Maybe. Hmm. Spell penetration is not terrible. Weapon focus is also not terrible. Hmm. Weapon focus is just not a bad skill in general. Resist poison and resist disease. Hmm. Maximize spell, lightning reflexes, improved initiative, which means you basically attack. You're more likely to attack faster. Cold shot, blind fight. It recommends power attack because I'm strong with 16 attack. Hmm. I personally would take a. Uh, personally would think about taking weapon focus. 
Zen Archery is also not bad if you have a very high dex. Hmm. I'll think about it. I'll think about it. Not letting us rest here anyway. So, I'll catch you next time, for when we come back, we shall level! We might go back into one of those back rooms, like, over there, and rest. But, I'll catch you then, folks. See you then. Later. I'm a bear! Bears! Ooh, there's loot there. Ooh, an axe. Bears!